Hey Dolly friend, this is Kat from the Dolly Insider. Let's sew a spooktacular outfit from Nandoroid Doll Book of Adorable Seasonal Outfits. The look we're going to sew is called Jack-O-Lantern. The final make is a pumpkin dress. Cut out and mark all pieces. You'll have 17 pieces total. Make sure when you cut the panel pieces that they are mirror images. To keep things straight, I added stickers to the wrong side of all the back panel pieces. I got confused when making this project and found labeling the front and back pieces helpful in keeping track of the pieces. I recommend doing the same to lessen confusion. To make the steps easier to follow along, let's get to know the panel pieces. The eight panel pieces are back middle, front middle, front side, back side. I'll refer to the panels as a number plus L or R throughout the video. These are not the official names for the panels. I came up with my own labeling system to help keep things clear. Let's build the front of the pumpkin dress. To get our bearings, we're going to be viewing the project from the wrong side. Grab the main piece and the 2R panel. Pin right sides together. I had trouble aligning the panel to the main piece. I'm not sure why that is. And so. Next, grab the 3R panel and pin it right sides together to the 2R panel. And so. One side of the pumpkin dress is complete. It's time to repeat the steps on the other side. Grab the main piece and the 2L panel. Pin the pieces right sides together and sew. Grab the 3L panel and pin it right sides together to the 2L panel and sew. With the front panels complete, it's time to work on the back panels. Grab the main piece and the 1R panel. Pin right sides together and sew. Next, grab the 4R panel and pin it right sides together to the 1R panel and sew. One back side is complete. It's time to repeat the steps on the other side. Grab the main piece and the 1L panel. Pin the piece right sides together and sew. Grab the 4L panel and pin it right sides together to the 1L panel and sew. This is what the pumpkin dress looks like from the right side once all panels are sewn. Grab the lining piece. Place the lining on top of the pumpkin dress, right sides together. Pin and sew. Repeat this for the other side. Pull the pumpkin dress through the lining so it's right side out. It's a tiny area to pull through. With right sides together, pin and sew the side seams. Turn the pumpkin dress right side out. Grab the waistband. Pin and sew the ends of the waistband. Pin the waistband to the bottom of the pumpkin dress. I chose to baste the waistband to the pumpkin before attaching it with a sewing machine. Sew the waistband to the pumpkin dress. Flip the waistband inside the pumpkin dress and tack the side seams down. Grab the pieces for the jack-o'-lantern face. Attach the felt pieces using glue and hand stitch the wire. The pumpkin dress is complete. I rate this project a determined beginner. If you're determined, you can tackle this project. If you prefer a text version of the steps in this video, download the PDF in the description below. I hope you decide to make this project for your doll. If you do, be sure to tag us at the Dolly Insider on Instagram so that we can see your look. You can also email us. See the description below for details. That wraps it up. My girl can't wait to wear her outfit out and about. Here she is wearing her jack-o'-lantern outfit. I hope you enjoyed this spooktacular sewing series. I can't wait to see what projects you make for your Nanderoid doll. Happy sewing! Bye!